the Border Collie doing a side-by-side -side comparison looking at their appearance, personality, training, and general care to keep them healthy and happy. Starting with the appearance of the Cocker Spaniel breed. Cocker Spaniels stand at 15 inches tall on average and can weigh anywhere from 24 to 28 pounds. Cocker Spaniels have a round, graceful head and a broad, square muzzle. Their ears are long and feathered. Perhaps most notable, however, is their long, silky coat with feathering not just on the ears, but also on the legs, chest, and underside. Cocker Spaniels can have a variety of colors. Some are solid black, red, or tan. Others are bicolored or tricolored. Some of the mixes you might see are black and tan, black and white, or black and white with tan flecks. Border Collies are medium-sized dogs standing at about 22 inches tall and weighing anywhere from 42 to 45 pounds. They look like a lighter weight Australian Shepherd. But instead of the bobtail characteristic of the Aussie, Border Collies have a feathered tail that reaches to the hocks. The ears stand, but the tips drop over, giving them a jaunty appearance. Some Border Collies have a coarse coat about three inches long, while others have a sleek coat about one inch long. A variety of colors are seen, including black and white, red and white, black and gray, all black, and tricolor. The longer-haired Border Collie usually has a lush mane and tail. Cocker Spaniels are known for being gentle, easygoing, and affectionate, yet lively. They're generally considered good with children. They tend to be non-aggressive toward other animals and people, but that also means that they're not particularly good watchdogs. Cocker Spaniel has a sweet temperament and is affectionate, cuddly, and loves to participate in family activities. It is playful, alert, and active, enjoying any exercise from easy backyard playing to full park activities. Border Collies are active, working dogs best suited to country living. If confined without activity and company, these dogs can become unhappy and destructive. The breed is highly intelligent, learns quickly, and responds well to praise. Because of their herding instincts, they're protective of their family and territory and make excellent watchdogs. They will look out for the family kids. Although they get along well with children and other pets they're raised with, they can be reserved and sometimes snappish with strangers, nipping at the heels, the same way they would nip at sheep if herding. The English Cocker is extremely trainable. They're intelligent and always eager to please, so this combined with their attentive nature means they learn quickly and are generally very obedient. When used as working dogs, Cocker Spaniels are trained to follow hand signals, which their owner uses to indicate where they should look or areas of interest. Although lively and active, their nature means that Cockers generally have very good recall. Their trainable nature means that house training is not typically a problem. Due to their smart character and sagacity, Border Collies learn very quickly, picking up on everything. It is important to train them from a young age to prevent bad habits. Barking and nipping are examples of bad habits they may develop when they don't have sufficient stimulation and get bored. Training them by keeping them focused on specific tasks will help keep them sharp, as their attention may wander easily. As upbeat, active sporting dogs, they both require daily exercise for their physical and mental well-being. They thrive when they have a job to do and space to run. They will do well with activities such as long walks or hikes with their owners. A Border Collie who doesn't work must be provided with vigorous exercise every day. Clearly, this is a breed for an active owner. There's a lot that you must do to maintain your Cocker Spaniel's looks. Their ears must be cleaned daily, their silky coat combed every other day, and their hair clipped every other month. Do not neglect to trim the hair on the dog's legs, tail, and head. On the average, the breed could use quarterly professional grooming services. There are two coat varieties for Border Collies. The soft-coated variety is short-haired throughout, while the rough-coated variety sports medium-length fur. Whichever coat your pet has, weekly or bi-weekly brushing is recommended. Both breeds are great family companions that have lots of energy and can be trained easily. If you're deciding between both breeds, know that you're in good hands with either as long as you give them enough exercise every day. Thanks for watching. We hope you're enjoying this format. If there is a breed you want to see, be sure to tell us in the comments below.